Orthodox churches held traditional Old Year's night services to herald in the new year 2016. Michael Kahn reports. The Orthodox churches began the countdown to 2016 with the traditional All Year's Night Mass where parishioners congregated and sought divine blessings. At the New Amsterdam Roman Catholic Church of Ascension, Father Michael Traer officially welcomed those in attendance before the open prayer and sermon. And welcome to our Mass this evening as we begin to enter a new year, a brand new year, and we do so under the patronage of Mary, the Mother of God, this particular day, this evening, this New Year's Day, is dedicated to Mary, the Mother of God. She was the Queen of Peace, who has given us the first child himself, who is the Prince of Peace. And so we gather in the name of the Father, and the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. The priests also urged the gathering to remain steadfast as they enter a new year with much hope. We gather at the end of the year, we look back and we ask ourselves, for what am I truly grateful? How is God touched by my life? Take a moment and let us be grateful for the ways that God has touched my life and my family. Now let's take a moment and ask ourselves the question, where have I failed to respond to God as my neighbor, or to my family, as God teaches me? Over at the All Saints Anglican Church, Father Garfield de Valier delivered stirring remarks to the congregation. For many of us, we are living by ourselves. We forget that God gives us what we have achieved in this life. In the new year, in a few seconds from now, we go into 2016. And I hope and pray that God will continue to work miracles in each and every one of us so we can do His will all the time and every time. For most of us, the work of the church is the priest. For most of us, the work of the church is the vestry. For most of us, the work of the church is the lay ministers. Brothers and sisters, what is your role and function in the church? The greatest commandment reminds us, love the Lord your God with all your heart, with all your soul, with all your strength, with all your mind, and love your neighbor as you love yourself. Father de Valier then encouraged the parishioners to exercise faith and embrace the meaning of brotherhood. The light shines in the darkness and the darkness did not overcome it. There was a man sent from God whose name was John. He came as a witness to testify to the light so that all might believe through him. He himself was not the light but he came to testify to the light. True light which enlightens everyone coming into the world. He was in the world and 
the world came through him, yet the world did not know him. He came to his own, and his own people did not receive him. But they not receive him, he gave them the power to become children of God. It is the hope of everyone that the new year will bring peace, prosperity, and more unity among each other. If you really have love for somebody, you're going to help them in good times and in bad times. Michael Kahn, Channel 8 News.